Wow, this looks really good. What looks good? This. Spice rubbed pork. Mm. Yeah, it sounds really good, but it's a mm. bummer we don't have any of this stuff. Mm. Hey, what's this? Blue Apron. Honey, we can totally do this. Yeah. Tonight's dinner is adapted from the winning dish seen in Bravo's Top Chef season 14 finale. The original recipe was created by this season's winner, Brooke Williamson. Our take features red onion two ways, roasted for a deliciously tender side and caramelized for a sweet addition to black beans. The centerpiece of roasted pork gets mild heat and fruity tang from guajillo chili powder. Are you guys ready to make a Blue Apron dinner? Let's go. Pork roast, black beans, garlic, red onion, cilantro, knickknacks. And my mitts. Ah. One, prepare the ingredients. Preheat the oven to 475. Yes, ma'am. And I will wash and dry the fresh produce. Next, peel in half the onion, small dice one half, and cut the remaining into one inch thick pieces. Okay, chef. Um, how, which way should I, which way should I cut this in half? Just in half. I mean, but like this, or like this? Well, it's half. Either way, just cut it in half. Okay. So as far as cooking is concerned, Samantha's the head chef, I'm her sous chef. Every time I do something in the kitchen, I need to ask her first what I'm doing. The best thing my mother ever cooked was beef stroganoff, hamburger helper style. And I will cut the garlic. Little tricks. Yes. Push it a little bit. Watch a lot of cooking shows, so. I don't. An old wives' tale is they used to keep, uh, they used to use onions to keep vampires away. That was garlic. Agree to disagree. Drain and rinse the beans. Thanks for giving me the onions, by the way. It's <laughs> exactly what I wanted. Mm. Drained cilantro. Finely chomp cilant chomp. <laughs> <laughs> Finally, chop the cilantro leaves and stems. Okay. Chop, 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 chop. Line a sheet pan with aluminum foil. Pat the pork dry with paper towels. Sweetie, I'll switch you. You can have the meat. Hi. So, I was a vegetarian for about eight years, and I thought I would never eat meat again. But then I met this guy, and I'll never go back. Season on all sides with salt, pepper, and spice blend. Had it dry first. Um, salt and pepper here. Get one of these. I'll sprinkle. That's all you need. All nice in there. <laughs> Take, okay, sweetie, I'm gonna let you do this and I'll read it off to you. Okay. Uh, you're gonna start that up. Medium high heat. Oh yeah. And one. All right, what's okay. next? Well, when it's hot, <clears throat> we're gonna put this on there to sear. The old. All right, sweetie. Put that in there. That's hot. Do it. That's hot. Put that in there. So you gotta add the seasoned pork and cook, turning occasionally three to five minutes or until browned on all sides, leaving any brown bits or fond in the pan on the stove. So let's put our timer on. Cooking time. Three, zero, zero, start. Not hours. Three. What is what it? Want? What do you want? Three minutes? No, yeah, 375. Oven? Three, Wait, what are you trying yeah, to do? Yeah, oven. And we need right, this. I can, t I can tell the time now. It's my kitchen. 
Okay. That's fine. And then while she's doing that, I'm going to place a sliced onion in a medium bowl. My sliced onion in, a, in this bowl. I'm going to drizzle with olive oil and season with salt and pepper. And I'm going to toss this to thoroughly coat. More salt and pepper. Of course. I don't want to use that. Where's the, uh... Where are your utensils? I have like this. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna put the onions on this side. With the seared pork. Yep. So our pork is not done. No, I know, but I have to just get this out of the way. Turning occasionally. Oh, I am supposed to turn them. My onions are se or seasoned. I'm putting them on the sheet pan, waiting for the pork to be seared. And once the pork is seared, this will go in the oven to roast for about 20 to 25 minutes, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, Mm, uh, 20 to 22 minutes. You're mistaken. I was mistaken. Oh, that looks great. Nice work. Nice. Okay, so now we are going to... This one? Doesn't matter. Okay, so now we're going to transfer the pork mm -hmm. onto this sheet pan, and we are going to roast this in the oven for about 20 to 22 minutes and start the preparation of the beans. Roast? 20 to 22 minutes. Okay, I'm gonna turn the timer on now. Alright. Okay, so kitchen timer. 22. Kitchen timer. 2 2. Oh, perfect. Nice. Okay, while the pork and onion roast in a small pot, heat the butter on medium high until melted. Medium high. Not too hot though, because last time I burned the butter. Thank you. And blah, blah, blah. Add the diced onion and season with salt and pepper. Yeah. So. We did eat a whole stick of butter once. <laughs> it was awful. It was delicious. Onions and what else? Because the onions, sweetie? Yes. Add the diced onions. Gotcha. Season with salt and pepper. See? Yeah. Cook, stirring occasionally, three to four minutes until lightly browned and slightly softened. Pepper. Where's the pepper? There it is. Ooh, this is gonna be good. <laughs> I just look at it like, oh. They've been cooking three to four minutes, what next? Add the brown sugar and a half cup of water. Okay. Brown sugar. Mm -hmm. Half cup of water. Check. Okay. Uh, 11 to 13 minutes until thick and saucy. Perfect. and season with salt and pepper. Yes, ma'am. Cook, stirring constantly. Do not burn the garlic. Okay. 30 seconds to a minute. Then add the beans. I'm doing the garlic stuff and I'm making it look real tough because garlic is the stuff when I like to... When are beans? Put the beans in. Okay. Put the beans in. Beans is in. Now I'm cooking the beans and stuff with the garlic and stuff. I've got a real winner, ladies and gentlemen. Sweetie, this is becoming thick and saucy. I think this might be a... Uh... Wait, when did I turn into the guy that's doing everything? I'm reading the ingredients. You're doing a great job. Like this? I am busy. The beans begin to break down? Are they breaking down? Not yet. I don't know what that means, though. So we have to... Vinegar. Okay. Add the honey. Okay. And the remaining vinegar. From Blue Apron. From Blue Apron. The whole All honey. All the honey, half the vinegar. <laughs> Ooh, That's that looks good. good. Mm. I ate some of the honey. Half of the vinegar. Okay. Half cup of water. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah. Language, sweetie. Hot damn. Remove from the oven, transfer the roasted pork to a cutting board, and let, let rest for five minutes. Oh my dear goodness. That looks delicious. Oh my goodness. 
Let rest for five minutes. Five minutes. Look at that. Drizzle the roasted onion with half the vinegar and carefully stir it to coat. Just eyeball it. Give like. Just eyeball it. A quarter of the cilantro. Bring it on over, that's sweetie. Fun. Put it on. Yeah, that's it. After five minutes of rest, find the lines of muscle or grain on the roasted pork. Thinly slice crosswise against the grain. Oh my gosh. And it smells amazing. Oh my gosh. Mm. I will hold that and you just... Um, just try. Alright. Look at that. I guess it's okay. Modern day geniuses. Divide the finished beans between two dishes. Top with a sliced pork, roasted onion, and a drizzle of olive oil. Garnish with the remaining cilantro and enjoy. Oh my oh. goodness. This is fantastic. Mm -mm -mm -mm. The onion goes where? Just on it? Yes. Nice. Okay, take that juice, dump it on here. Mmm. Little juice? Mmm. Mm -hmm. I think she gave herself more, but I'm okay with it. Always, you always think that. Mmm. Bon appetit? Yes. Thank you, Blue Apron. But I am curious what the placement of this. I'm not good at placing food. <laughs> Plating. Plating. Uh, I gave you a right. Damage. You always think that. I do not have more than time. you. It's true this time. It's really good. Mm -hmm. We bicker, we argue, we make Blue Apron meals, we go to bed happy. Thank you. This is how it works though. The banter is real. 